I'm not selling unless I can get this much money in my pocket. My goal is to help you earn the highest amount of profit on your investment in the shortest amount of time. If we haven't met, welcome, and thank you for choosing to take some time to invest in yourself and your real estate moves. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and bell notification so you don't miss more videos like this one. I'm Caitlin Henderson, a realtor serving Middle Tennessee, raised in the business and in the area. I believe in authentic real estate and want to help as many people that want more for themselves as possible. Let's get to what you came for. There are three factors that influence the sale of your home. One, market conditions. These are things we can't control like the economy, location, competition, and the financial market. Two is a seller. That's you and your decisions. You decide the price and terms, timeline and motivation, condition of the property, and availability for showings. Three, you're a realtor. This includes their network, advertising, marketing, and more. Many sellers think they want to test the market. Trust me, don't test the market. Accurate pricing is the first and one of the most important aspects when selling your home. The combination of attractive pricing and presentation are essential for a successful sale. The first two to three weeks on the market are crucial as buyers display high interest in new listings. Markets are dynamic and the price you set has an expiration date. The longer it sits on the market, the less you'll make trying to recover. An important thing to note, and this won't be the last time you hear me say this, the market sets the range, the seller sets the price, and the buyer sets the value. If you as the seller want to list high to test the market, guess what? If you value your home more than anyone else, you get to keep it. This is where your agent comes in to help you with optimal positioning and strategic pricing based on the market to sell for the highest price in the shortest amount of time. It's hard to see flaws in your own home sometimes after being there so long. You've got shared memories that were created there, I understand. Something I've considered doing for sellers with a mother's love towards their own house is to show them other homes on the market within their desired asking price range and then asking them objectively, is your home in better or worse condition than these? Then let them find that truth for themselves because no one else wants to call your baby ugly either. Chances are it might just need a bath or a new outfit or a little makeover. Hopefully you followed that analogy. Hopefully you found this helpful. Let me know if you'd like to see more seller related videos. I've already got ideas flooding in after recording this one, but I wanted to keep this one short and sweet for you today. Hey, cheers to you for taking the time to learn something for yourself in the real estate world. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss anything coming in the next few weeks. We're gonna talk a lot more about seller tips. And because my goal is to help you earn the highest amount of profit on your investment in the shortest amount of time, if you're in the area and would like to know what selling your home or property might look like for you this year, there's a link to book a totally no pressure call with me below. Or if you're out of state, I have wonderful referral partners all over the country that I have real relationships with and would love to connect to you should it be a good fit. I look forward to hearing your story, answering your questions, and helping you have absolute clarity on what your next best steps are for your unique situation in real estate. Until next time, enjoy the journey.